this little cue here already looks like this to her. So, uh -huh. so that they're they've got such a big eyeball, they can see little tiny changes, and I want to respond to those changes. So, so when she feels the stick come up to her shoulder, she should start leaving, and I escalate my cue into four phases of pressure. I show her the stick, wave the stick, I just kind of start to tap, 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 tap. Then when she left, I just left her alone. I just want her to stay parallel to the flicker. I'll let her travel. I'll let her travel. I'll let her travel. When that stick comes down to here, you should start to move your hip away from me. And if you fail, she brought her nose into me. I, that's where I quit. Thank you. Stay away from the whip. And when she's going to the right, I'm going to make every effort just to kind of pivot on my right foot here. I'll take a hold of my right foot. Okay. And then when I put the whip down here, she should move the dip right there when she did. I quit. See how, see how much quieter you can be? Get up here. If you fail me, if you fail me, if you fail me, right here, I'll correct it for turning the wrong way. I'm asking for the hit here, the hit here. If you pass me, I'll pass. I'm asking for your hip. Failure. I'm asking for your hip. Failure. Go through this little gap I created. I want her to reach me. I want her to reach this. It's okay to shoot me this gap. I'm asking for the hip. There you go. I don't get all bent over an anime. Right here. What are you, what are you supposed to do? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. So now, uh, just try to keep that thing hanging like a pendulum so that she's good. Oh, so she doesn't see any miscue or fake cue or false cue. Okay. Now when you're ready, tap, tap, tap. there. Now just hold it up parallel when she moves. Okay. There. Hold it parallel to the horse. Now just go down towards the hip. Tap, 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 tap. Till the hip swings away. Tap harder. Harder. Harder on the ground. There. Harder on the ground. There. There. And I try to do it all with one hand. Okay. The driver. Tap, tap. And I kind of hold the whip more this way. Yeah. And just keep it parallel. Keep, keep your left, just hook your left thumb in your pants pocket so you're not tempted to be hand signal. There. Now drive her out a farther away from you. Parallel. Now get that hand back in your pocket. There. Drive her away with the whip. Pivot on your left hand. There you go. Just get her out away from you. And, and don't go up and down with it there. Just kind of drive it after. Horizontal and parallel to the horse. Now you're asking for direction. There you go. And get her out of the way from you. There you go. There you go. Now tap the ground. There she comes. Neutralize your whip. It costs you something. You're not getting trying to, trying to do too much body language. Because this one, don't go up and down. Wait after. There you go. Set her out the way now. A little fun. Parallel to the horse. Parallel to the horse. There. And then right down towards the hip. There. How'd you like that? That was pretty. Kind of cool, that was isn't fun. it? Now he's, I should be able to hurt him with the whip. Now he's trying to keep that lead line soft. I'm pivoting on my left foot here. Drop it down towards the hip. She moves away. Tell him how smart he is. <laughs> Tell him how smart he is. <laughs> Alright, you get the whip to this shoulder. And I want to drive the shoulder out just a little bit. There. Hurt him. Hurt him. And if he starts if he starts to quit, then I'll just kind of re-engage you. Just kind of wave it at him with a little what I call driving motion, and now a parking motion, parking, parking, parking motion. Right here, now move this hip, nice. Good boy. Nice. That was gorgeous. Now move your shoulder. Now I can tip it on my right foot. If he quits on me, I can just kind of wave it at him a little bit, encourage him to move. Direction change, please. Yeah. There. Now he kind of parked a little bit, and I just kind of tapped the ground, and he swung the hip away. Yeah. Heard him away with my pivot on my right foot. Yeah. Now let's see if he'll come to us, dip in, because I bring the, the whip up. Okay. So now I can say 
putting them away. I want to just remember this, this angle, this angle meant something this could go. Oh, good this job. Oh. <laughs> Nicely done. So now I can say, this angle means what? That's right. That's right. Oh, wow. And then this angle means move, move away, move your hip, not, not in, not in, not there, away. Move yourself forward, please. Move your hip away, please. Move your hip in, please. That Gorgeous. Is so cool. I just I'm just jumping into cheering over here quietly.